Hi everyone, welcome back to our new session of the UI path. In this session, I will explain you about how to work with groups in UI path for fr Freshdisk account. So whenever we are working with Freshdisk automation or performing the activities by using some automation tool or by using UI path, it's very much required to have a valid connection here. So I have already created one session on how to establish a valid connection using UiPath or you can say integration of UiPath in Freshdisk account which will help you to create a valid connection. After that we can perform several actions like adding group, adding tickets, deleting extracting a list of tickets or groups then updating the group detail as well which will help to perform the task which you want or required task in easiest way or in a less span of time so if you are new to this channel consider subscribing and pressing bell icon for more updates let's begin with this for adding tasks extracting group list, updating group list and deleting groups. We will need three steps to be performed. One is valid connection should be established. Other we will need to have a packages or required packages for fresh disk account. For installing the fresh disk packages just have to go to manage packages. From the manage packages you can install fresh disk packages which is created by Christian Negloci and it's very important to use or it's very helpful to perform activities in UI path. So let's see how we can add a group and then we will perform several other actions. Let's drag and drop this activity. For adding any group, we just have to configure some parameters which is required. So let me click on get mandatory parameter. So there is one, one get mandatory parameter. If we want to add some other parameters like description of the group, then we can add some other detail as well. Created add. So just so let me enter let me close this so for adding name of the group I am giving here maintenance group description this is auto generated group using UI path which is helpful for men maintenance activity then let's enter created date so here I am giving 09082020 let's run the command we are getting invalid field or request detail so might be we are entering some other formats so we need to have 8th of July and the timestamp as well so here twenty thirty eight 47 
that is not taking it might be take for while the creations so let's run only these two now you can see add group is added successfully let me copy and if you want to reward this group which is automatically created by the script you can just click on the reward command it will be rewarded automatically let's check the group now in the group activity i'm not sure where will we will get that group name let me click on group name search bar group name maintenance group let's refresh the page then we'll check it Now you can see maintenance group is successfully added. Before when we checked, so it was not available here. Let's do some other task. Let's extract the group list which is available in your account. So for if you want to extract any specific group which you have already known the group ID or the detail of the group. then you can enter the detail and extract it by just clicking on the run select command but if you want to extract rest of the data like this agent id this social updated at name auto ticket assign these activity you can get it but right now i just want the group id i just created or the group id which is present in my system as well so let me run select a command and you can see whatever group is available inside my account all the groups details are available here so let me select the name as well so that it will be easy for us to get it now you can see whatever group detail is available in our system all the group details are listed here as you can see here maintenance group is we just have created and that group is available inside this so by this way we can extract the group list from our fresh disk account let's check the update sections so we have to enter here the group id which we want to update it so enter the group id and click on okay and now next configure the other parameters i just wanted to update the group name so Here, maintenance group ops. Let's run this command and check the detail from extract list because the detail is updated. Let me run the command, and you can see here maintenance group ops is successfully updated. You can see here the detail which we have provided for updating the data. And finally, if we want to delete any specific group, we just have to drag and drop delete group activity and enter here the group ID. Once we'll enter is if we want to remove these activity or comment it out. save all the activities after saving just have to run debug file once the execution is completed the group id which we have provided in delete group activity is permanently removed from our system so by this way we can perform several other actions on group like adding deleting update and extract group list 
So let's recap with this. We have started with the fresh desk application scope activity. Test connection should be validated, and once the valid connection is established, we need to have a activity add group activity for adding a new group. Then we have checked about a bit group, then extracted complete list of group detail, and finally we have deleted the group which is unnecessarily or inactive or whatever is your requirement so by this way we can perform several actions on group listing in fresh desk automatically hope you like it if you really enjoyed this video consider subscribing and pressing bell icon for more updates thank you